You probably remember acid and alkaline from science class, but what do they have to do with your diet? So the alkaline diet is essentially an effort to maintain a balance between the types of foods you eat on the acidic side of the scale and on the alkaline side of the scale. It turns out acidic foods are mostly processed meats and dairy. Other acidic foods include flour, sugar, and soy. Alkaline foods are mostly fruits and veggies, also wild rice, honey, and green tea. So when we, when we ingest an acidic diet, the body has to buffer that. And the way it adjusts is by pulling um, the central minerals things like calcium, magnesium, and potassium from our bones, from other vital areas. Good thing I have this alkaline water. And the idea is that if you drink that water, you will alkalinize your body. My concern is that a lot of this is sort of a marketing marketing thing, and you can always find something new to sell. So the alkaline water may not be a miracle worker, but we've got a list of better ways you can alkalize your body. Number one, colorful foods. We really want to be eating from a rainbow of colors because the things that give the plant-based foods the color are these amazing phytochemicals that give us health-promoting properties. The docs say you want greens, healthy proteins like legumes and nuts, and cold water fatty fish in every meal. Next, water. I'm a little less concerned about the types of water people are having as long as it's clean and it's not polluted in any way. They recommend spring water from trusted sources over the pricey alkaline stuff. Third, sleep. That stress that's induced from not sleeping enough. You know, if you sleep just three, four hours a night, you're almost in a pre-diabetic state based on a lot of markers. And finally, light exercise. They say gentle stretching, walking, and yoga promote better health than intense workouts. The verdict? It's not about those $4 bottles of water. Because as long as you're consuming enough vegetables, you really are alkalizing your body. That's the bottom line on Alkaline on the to-do list.